Good spot, young man, that is Paul Smith. Put your hands together, please. Seven-time British Auto Test Champion, world record holder, driver of this Ford Cosworth, and an all-round nice guy, Paul Smith. How are you, sir? Very good, how are you? I'm not bad. How's that for an introduction? I love this car. I meant what I said. But tell us about this car. What a fantastic car. There's a lot of them here today. A lot of the guys will know and love this car as well. Yeah, this is a uh, Escort Cosworth, uh, obviously. Uh, Yeah, 96 model bought down by the Ford Heritage Centre. A lot of horsepower on the bonnet, a lot of performance. You're probably going to need a car like this for the show. Uh, not necessarily, Kevin. Um, today we've actually got the all-new Focus that we're going to be using uh, in the show, and uh, yeah, we hope to uh, put that through its paces. So just to say that, Paul, you're not going to be in the show in the Escort Cosmos. You're doing it in a standard, brand-new Ford Focus. Yeah, um, we, we don't need all, all the power and the, the technology we've got here. We're going to try and uh, do everything we possibly can with the, with the new Focus. It's, um, all we've done is pump up the tyre pressure to disconnect the ABS pump, and that's a standard car. Fantastic, there you go. Standard Ford Focus, just with the tyre pressure pumped up a little bit and no ABS. We've got a guy in there as well, his name's Lawrence. Lawrence, put your hand out the window, give us a wave. Lawrence uh, went onto the Ford Fair Facebook site, click like, enter the competition, and that's why he's here. And we've got some other competition winners who are going to join us as well. Other competitions running throughout the day. So if you want to be part of the show, make sure you see the guys in the Ford stand. So, Paul, uh, you got the Focus, you got Lawrence. What are you going to be doing for us first up? The uh, first thing we're going to do is a, a J-turn or a reverse spin. You've all seen it in the movies where the guy's trying to get away from a baddie. So I'm going to the top of the, uh, top of the arena, get up to as much speed as I can backwards, spin the car through these two rocks and see if they stop before those people just rock. What, where that young man is the green top down there on the right? Just the top there, yeah. He's got the best seats in the house, that little guy down there. Right, OK. Here's the deal, ladies and gentlemen, here's the deal. Paul, he teaches this to the police, the army, to stun drivers, TV, film, and all sorts. And what he's going to do then, he's going to go up to, I think, this end up here and start. He's going to throw it backwards at about 30 to 40 miles an hour. Then with the help of the hand, the stand of the Ford Focus, spin it through the gap here. He's going to stop just before the young man in the green top and red shorts down there. Hopefully, hopefully. It's the first show, uh, so we'll see what happens. But the deal is this, folks. The deal is this. It's an, it's an audience participation show, right? So what that means is, if we ask you to make some noise, to whoop, holler, go mad and cheer, then these gaps between the cars will get smaller, okay? And if we cheer loud enough, he will go faster. So let's have a little practice, folks, on this side down here. Let me hear you make some noise. Not bad. You guys over here with the team captain of the man in the red shorts and the green top, make some noise. So much better, so much better. Far end, far end, let's hear. Make some noise at the far end. Easily the best, easily the best. Right, petrol heads, are you ready? Okay, then petrol heads, take it away. Pull, three, two, one, away you go. What do we think? Smaller gap, do we want a smaller gap? Yeah, we want a smaller gap. So let's hear you cheer for the smaller gap.
in Tesco's and he's really got to get in there and get his, uh, I don't know, case of baby shan before they sell out. There's one space left and this is how you can grab that last space. It's a kind of parallel parking, kind of reverse parking manoeuvre. What's going to happen is he's going to roar down here, straight at this focus here. It looks like he's going to hit the bonnet and then at just the right moment with a little bit of handbrake and a little bit of the steering wheel, hopefully put it in the space. All set, Paul. Thumbs up. Petrol heads. Take it away. Here we go then, folks. Cameras are the ready. Make some noise in three, two, one. Here we go. Oh, how about that? Right in the middle. What do you think? Give a round of applause. Come on, now. That's a very big space, Paul. You could get a bus in there. What do you think? We need a long run up, we need more speed. More speed, folks. You guys are the ready with the cameras, you're in the box seat for this one. What a big cheer if she gets it in and doesn't hear any of the cars. Okay, Paul, are you ready? Three! Just gonna spin it around. Here we go then. Alright, cameras are the ready, youtube.com in the morning. Three, two, one, let's do it! Easily straight in. Too easy. Too easy. Oh, come on. That's a massive space. What? You want this where? Here? No way. What do you think, folks? Should we do it? Should we do it? Yeah, of course we can do it. Mark, I know it's a lovely car. I know it's brand new. But he said, put it there. Wow. All right. Let's see what happens. You guys got a great view. Cameras at the ready. Check out Paul Swift's Facebook page and upload your pictures and video of this event as well. All right, Paul, you know what? I've got to get out of the way. Ready then? Three, two. Oh, closer? No way! No way, folks, this is like one car whip. I've never seen him do it this time. Never seen him do this time. You ready, Paul? Three, two, one. Take it away! Focus can actually park itself. So, for a moment, my friend, you're kind of redundant. Go on, I don't know. I tell you what, if you park this white one just over there, I'll show you how the Focus can park itself. I, I'm serious, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, that's it. Yeah, sorry, folks. We don't actually need Paul for this bit. We know he's good at parking, we know he's good at driving, but if you're not as good as him, if, like me, you take, I don't know, three, four, five, six goes to get into that parallel parking space, then you might like this feature on the new Ford. It's got an auto park feature, so you can literally press the button on the dashboard, take your hands off the wheel, that's it, you don't touch it, and the car will park itself. Tim here only passed his test this week, and uh, we had to get him to pass his test just so he could do this bit. He was rubbish at parallel parking, so you can just press the button. His hands are now off the wheel. All you've got to do is just engage reverse gear, wait till the car beeps, put it in first gear, roll forwards, and it has parked itself. And this is available now on new Ford. So if you want to have a look at it, come and see us after the show, and you can get in the car, and you'll see it work yourself. So there you go. How about that? Parking itself. What do you think, ladies and gentlemen? Should we give Tim a round of applause? I know he didn't do anything. That's the whole point. You just press the button on the dashboard button. I could do that, but with my other button, Show us the other button. Tim. Tim, you pull it forward there. Now, your, your car, uh, Tim, can get into a space just 20% longer than the car itself. 
So I don't think we'll give Paul much more than that. And he reckons he can do it with his magic handbrake button. So let's see if he can. <laughs> you get a set up from over there, have a little look. He's making the gap a bit smaller, I think. What's the time now? Don't forget, of course, the focus could do it in a, just 20% longer than one car length. Right, Petrohead, I think we need a bit of a tune for this one. Are you ready then? Are you ready, Paul? Thumbs up. Petrohead, take it away. A three, two, one, here we go. Go on then. Make it smaller? I can't hear him either, Paul. What's your... Do you want it smaller? Okay, right, you guys on this side and you guys on this side, you can see the gap. Just keep cheering and we'll stop when you stop. Who's in the bus? Did you see? Is she saying no? She's saying no. No. Well, this is the lady who's going to be with you a little bit later on. She's got more thrills to come. Another competition with Nick. Right, pull this forward then. Pull this forward. You guys cheer, we'll keep going. When, when should he stop? When should he stop? What do you think? You guys over here, a bit more? A bit more? What do they think, Paul? A bit more? You guys over here, a bit more? Yeah, why not? A bit more. Whoa, that's a little bit. Wait a minute, it's a bit tight, that, Paul. First show of the day and all that, you're not warmed up. Whoa, okay. These guys might not see the next two shows, so I might as well give them I like it, I like it. Yeah, we've got, we got two more shows today, but if you only see this one, of course, then uh, we've got to make it a good one for you, so Paul's just going to get out of the space. Might need the parking sensors to get you out. Let's have a look. There we go, we're out. Right, so Paul's out of his face. We've got a tiny gap here. Pedro, has ready for some musical accompaniments? Okay, chaps, take it away, ladies and gentlemen. Are you ready? There we go, then. Tiny, tiny space. Give him a big cheer if he gets it in there, okay? Here we go. Three, two, one, away you go. Well, we're rolling over the fence in the wall, baby. Fireball, boom. Take the band out. <laughs> do you want another go or not? Are we done? <laughs> we'll call it a day there on that one. What do you think? That, they said no. These guys, I don't, I don't think they're bothered. These guys, I don't think they're bothered. But I mean, do we want him to do it again? Right, come on, let's do it again. Let's see if we can kind of... There's a bit of room at the front. Perhaps we can lose a bit of room at the front. Of course, now the Focus does it in space just 20% longer than the car itself. And I don't think probably you've got much more than that. Uh, it is the first one of the day, so you've got to get your eye in. And of course, this is a standard Ford Focus that Paul's using here. So just have a think on this, what he's doing. Uh, it really is quite tricky. We've never touched a car yet. There's always a first time. Mark, you're, you're not happy either, are you? No, I'm so happy. Right, the band, I've got to see him now. Dan and Alex there from the Petrol Heads, true rock stars here today. Big thanks to those guys as well, of course. Right, come on, lads, let's get this one out. Forwards, backwards. Hopefully it'll go in there a little bit easier than it'll come out. Whoa, lads, what's going on? Isn't there a quick way that you can get this out, Paul? I know, it's making me nervous. That's a brand new focus. Right, so we're out. Okay. <laughs> No, it doesn't look happy with me. This is a very small gap for the first show of the day. Right, here's the deal with them, folks. If he gets in, we've got to give a really big cheer because genuinely this is a very, very small gap we're going to get into. Cameras at the ready. Uh, Paul, can you give me a little, a little smile at least? Here we go. Petrol heads, take it away. In three, two, one. Here we go. Crazy. Yeah, the 